anointing. I thank you for the saints, the saints of God. Amen. I thank him for all things. The Bible says, give thanks in all things, because it's the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning us. But I, I appreciate the Lord. Do you appreciate the Lord? Amen. Amen. For all that he has done and all that he is doing. And I thank him for waking us up this morning and literally just starting us on our, our way. We ought to thank and praise him because he called us into holiness. He called us into righteousness. You know, uh, we often, uh, we do not uh, take our position and our, our place in holiness for granted. Because you could be in a place where uh, they're even teaching the Bible, but they're not living uh, what they're teaching. They don't really believe in what they're teaching. Amen? No? And God is not backing what they're teaching. But we thank God, as Paul says, in him we live, in him we move, and in him we have our being. And we praise and thank the Lord uh, for being mindful of us, dwelling with us. Being among us. Amen? Hallelujah. Uh, because it's good to, to have the Lord on your side. Not only is it good, but it's the best, it's the best life. Yeah. Amen. Holiness and righteousness is the best life. Hallelujah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so as we get ready to go before the Lord in prayer, uh, we certainly want to remember men and women and children everywhere that the Lord will uh, continue to save and add to the church daily such as should be saved. And also, let us pray for any bereaved families that have lost loved ones that uh, are going through uh, their mourning period. Uh, pray that the Lord will continue to comfort and give strength. Also, uh, pray for those that um, have been affected with this virus, uh, that the Lord will uh, heal their bodies and, and touch their minds and their spirit, and that the Lord will keep us and strengthen us at all times. Amen. Uh, are there any other uh, particular prayer requests? Thank you, Jesus. Continue to pray for Sister Priscilla. Yes. Pray for the Hamilton family. Amen. Um, who is Janice's children's grandmother that passed. All right. Amen. We certainly want to pray for them. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. All right. We'll ask the church to stand. Saints, don't stop praying. For the Lord is nigh. Saints don't stop praying. Hear me, O God.
that, that, that I will give for you unto you for this purpose. Uh, uh, yeah. that, that, that he said to make me a minister. Did he say that? I'm going I'm to make you a minister. You're going to be my servant. Uh, yeah. and, and I'm going to take you from the people to whom now I send you back to. Uh, uh, yeah. Why? Your mission, your goal is to turn from darkness to light. From the power of Satan unto God, uh, so that they can receive repentance and remission of sins. Uh, amen? Uh, and the inheritance among them that are sanctified. Uh, that's, that's why God has called you. That's why God has sanctified you. Amen? You've got a purpose. You've got a mission. Uh, you, God has put a plan in motion and it has you involved in it. Amen. Even when, when God uh, 
was giving out his Ten Commandments. He, one of those commandments is, don't take the name uh, of my Lord thy God, but in vain. Don't use it uh, in vain. Don't use it.
Amen. You know, uh, uh, Kurt Franklin, he had a song out there. When he was singing that song, uh, something about the name of Jesus. Uh, and in, in, in the introduction of it, and he was saying that people really don't use, they stop using that name. Amen. And, that, and that's true today. Yeah. People, people really uh, don't, don't, don't recognize and use the name Jesus. Yes. And that uh, the saints of God, if anybody should use the name Jesus, we ought to use the name Jesus. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. We should Amen. walk in that name. Yes. We should we should be mindful, like we need uh, uh, oftentimes now I wear a hat. Amen. I wear a hat. And when I go outside without a hat, I'm mindful that I don't have a hat on. Amen. I'm mindful of that. Uh, yeah. What I do? Go back to my hat. Go back and get uh, uh, so when we when we as saints of God, as we live this life, we should be mindful. Right. Yeah. Uh, all that name. Yeah. Uh, and, and specifically mindful when we're not using that name. Right. Amen. Uh, and then when we understand that we're not using that name, all that we are. You know, uh, uh, I don't want to pray for this, but, 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 you know, it would be good for us if we don't get victories unless we use that name. And that would make us use that name more often. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. We can say to ourselves, yeah. I've been losing, I've been, I've been falling short. How do I have been falling short? No! I haven't been using the name! Right! Uh, that, that'll put you in your fear of remembrance. Right. Amen? Oh, uh, God, you
person does come to the Lord and he cleanses them up, he cleans them up. Yeah. That's why the Bible calls it a profession. Yeah. And in a profession, you work at your craft. Uh -huh. And the Holy Ghost is a profession. Yeah. And, and the more you practice it, mm -hmm. the better off you become. You don't want to go back. Yeah. You want to go higher. Yeah. Because you're you're working towards something yes. that is going to profit you yes. in the end result, yes. which would profit us eternal life. My God. And so that's why we have to keep coming to the church, yes. staying on our knees, My God. seeking God, yes. that we may become better saints, yes. and and that the world will see that. It's God. That's it. yeah. it's, it's God. Yeah. It, it's got to be God because I knew him. Yeah. When he was in his mess. Yeah. I knew her when she was in her mess. Mm -hmm. And now she's she she's shining like new money. Yes. Because uh -huh. God is working. 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 And sanctifying her. Yeah. My clean, clean, clean person. Amen. Paul said this. As far as uh, uh, Pat, he said, I'm forgetting those things that are behind. behind. Mm -hmm. I'm reaching for those things that are what? Before. Huh? Then he said, then he said, I press for the mark of the prize of the high glory of God, which is in Christ Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. When, when a child of God gets into the body of Christ, Come on. that should be. Their mindset. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, that, that I'm done with war. Mm -hmm. right. yeah. I'm done with Satan. Yeah. Uh, I'm done with evil. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm done with the bad habits. Right. Uh, I'm done with the kingdom. Yeah. And instead of focusing in on the kingdom and, the, and, and that which you left behind, you got to focus on that which is before you. Right. Oh, yeah. God. Right. Thank you, Jesus. You gotta see Jesus. Yeah. Amen. You gotta see him. Yeah. Uh, that, that should be your mindset. Yeah. Uh, when, when shortcomings come or, or reveal because you know God is with you. Right. One of the, the hardest things that the enemy does to a baby saint is that you ain't saved. Yeah. Uh, God, God don't care nothing about you. You don't have a holy ghost.
Yes. Then we become ambassadors yes. to Jesus Christ. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. When our ambassador of the United States goes out, yes. he don't talk about him. No. He don't talk about nothing else but what the United States say. Come on in. Uh, and when we come out after he has cleansed us, yes. we talk about nothing but Jesus Christ. Nothing but Jesus. And yes. he'll crucify us. Yes, it's up there. Turn it up and go in his mouth. Say Jesus Christ and him That's right. That's what we represent. Now he says something about that. When the ambassador goes out to represent the nation, he don't talk about his ideas. Yeah. And his ideas may not even uh, uh, conform to what the nation ideas are. Uh, but, but because of who he's representing, uh, it's nevertheless not obvious, mm -hmm. but that I will be done. Right. Amen. I don't go out saying uh, uh, right quick. No. Now, I don't go out representing my name. No. <laughs> you should go out representing your name. Right. Uh, you got to represent the one who sent
Well, you can say that, absolutely. Because God does give us space to repent. Yeah, when he gives us space to repent. Yeah. And they get to the came forth. And I uh, didn't make sense. If he would have, if he would have, after he had stolen stuff, hid stuff, came to Joshua before they went out to battle, yeah. say, hey, don't, just, hey, I got, I got this stuff here. Huh? I got this stuff here that I stole. <laughs> Tell me I got this stuff here that I stole. You know, I, I beg you that you pray that the Lord would forgive me. But because he didn't, everything connected to him had to die. Had to die. Had to die. Your sin will buy you out. Yes. Your sin has consequences. Yes, it does. Amen. Yes, it That's why God cleanses you from all your guilt. Yes. Because He understands the consequences yes. of sin. Yes, He does. Amen. Yes. The confession is good for the soul. Absolutely. Absolutely. Good for the soul. A broken spirit and a contrary heart, mm -hmm. he will in no wise despise. He cleanses us from all of our guilt. Yeah. Amen. So that we don't, he doesn't expect us to go back and get filthy again. No. Now he's made provision for us when we do get filthy again. Right. Yeah. But it's not his expectation. Right. Yeah. It's not his fear. Right. It's not his desire. It's not his desire. Size her. Amen. He knows what he's believing. <laughs> hey. Oh, oh. Uh, uh. Right. He says, I'm cleansing you from all your filth and, and notice what he said, from all your what? Idols. Idols. Amen. Uh, Israel, they were plagued throughout their history serving idols. They never got rid of their own. But this stuff that they learned back in Egypt, they passed that on from generation to generation to generation to generation. Uh, they, they would literally pray to God and then they would go pray to a statue uh, that they made. They would pray to their statue. That's what the Bible talks about. High places. Uh, some kings got rid of the high places. That those high places were idols that they worshipped. Right. Uh, and didn't try to serve God. Even God was merciful well, to them because he was uh, working their this. But when we get saved, don't think that, uh, let me say it a different way. When you get saved, get rid of all your idols. Right. Huh? Right. Get rid of all your idols. He mentioned the numbers. The numbers is an idol. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yeah. Spirit, the spirit of witchcraft. Yeah. Huh? One, one to, uh, uh, the spirit of chance. Yeah. Huh? Right. But, yeah. uh, 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 we have a bunch of idols. That, that, that can plague our lives. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Those things, those things, plague the Holy Ghost work for you. Yes. Uh, I, and you know, he says, tell them that I do this. Whatever they can depend on, that is not God. Uh, right. Yeah. 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 That insults itself against the knowledge of God. That's mm -hmm. right. Huh? Amen. 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 Absolutely. <laughs> 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 And, and uh, she had the baby. I said, now I'm going to feed the baby. 
Thank you. 
that should have known who he was. Amen? Huh? And he said, who shall declare my generation? Amen? They should have, instead of putting him to death, they should have been able to point to him. Uh, like, this is the cross. Like John the Baptist. This is the cross. This is the one. Yeah. Uh, but, but, they, but they did not. Amen. Uh, let's not deny Jesus. Uh, yeah. Hallelujah. He's depending on you. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. 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 Yes.